Hey loves, this is going to be a general reading for all signs. I'm going to start off your reading with some oracle messages and I will get into the tarot. For those of you interested in learning how to read tarot, my training is down below. Also, for those of you interested in a personal reading, you can visit my website at swordstarot.com. So what are the messages for the collective? Setting the record straight. Okay. We have fake friends here as well. For some of you, you may confront somebody or vice versa, but I'm feeling like it's you needing to confront somebody about something. Maybe you found out about something in the pre-shuffle. I was getting the energy of like private relationships. I was also getting the energy like somebody wants to contribute more. So for some of you, you are connecting with somebody new and they want to figure out what's their next move towards you. They want to make a move, but they don't know what to do. So we have trash, getting rid of, throwing away, tossing out. Yeah, for a lot of you, you're, you know, cutting things out that no longer serve you. We have bank failure. For a lot of you, you can be focused on your money. I am getting as well. Um, for some of you, maybe someone was using you for money. That's not going to be for everyone, but you could have kicked this person to the curve. We have tired of drama and depression. Yeah, I feel like whoever I'm picking up on, you know, some of the people in your life, whether this is family members, friends, coworkers, love relationships, you may have realized these people or this person has been draining your energy, knowing they fucked up. Yeah, for a lot of you, you walked away from somebody. You set the record straight. You threw them in the trash here and now they know they fucked up. Caught, finding evidence, getting caught cheating. Somebody may have got caught cheating. And you walked away. They know they fucked up. Keeping you a secret. Yeah, somebody could have kept a secret from you. You walked away. I definitely feel like I'm picking up someone that already walked away. And this person is now... They regret their decision. Maybe they made the wrong choice as well. Maybe they went for somebody else. They made the wrong choice. across the room here and I feel drawn to take it so I gotta get it ego letting ego get in the way of relationships so for some of you this could have been a situation to where maybe you weren't dating this person maybe things just didn't get off the ground but some way somehow they messed up maybe they made another choice or maybe they went back to the past or there's something here about somebody messing things up and I feel like you just dusted it off you're like okay well you know whatever if you're not interested or if this is not what's supposed to happen, then okay. I feel like you just kind of went back to focusing on yourself, hustling. I'm doing what you need to do. Um, we do have photo proof getting evidence. So again, this, I feel like you're going to catch somebody in a situation if you haven't already. Like you're going to catch someone. Yeah, you're going to catch someone doing something. Check the bank. Okay, this is like for someone that's probably like been together for a while or someone that's married. Check the bank account. I feel like, I don't know, you're going to find what you're looking for. This person's going to find what they're looking for. I'm feeling that somebody's trying to, maybe somebody has fake accounts. There's some shady shit happening here. And I feel like you're going to find evidence of something. Someone's keeping a secret here. We have an interesting. I'm getting another storyline here for those of you that are not dealing with this. Um, and you're dealing with a new person that they let their ego get in the way of this connection they may have acted uninterested and that could have been why um that like they know they fucked up they act up they acted uninterested they allowed their ego to get in the way they allowed fear to get in the way child services damn okay so yeah for somebody i'm picking up on a lot of energies here for someone and this could be like again a situation to where you have kids with someone maybe you're married maybe something Someone's trying to like catch something here. It could have to do with the child. Maybe somebody is trying to call child services on you. Something. You got somebody here trying to get evidence. Yeah, getting evidence. One more. Boss daddy, for a lot of you, you're very focused on your finances. Again, I do feel like um, there could be somebody here. Maybe someone was using you uh, for money. For some of you, you could be a business owner or just uh, be very stable financially. You could be very good with your money. And we have creeping. So yeah, you got you got people here like trying to. I don't know. I'm just looking at that haunted car. Like maybe this person's like trying to haunt you, trying to cause issues in your life on purpose. 
definitely is feeling like an angry ex type of energy or just like a salty someone's salty is what i'm getting and they're trying to catch you doing something that maybe you're not even doing but it's like they're trying to i want to say revenge i feel like they're trying to get back at you for walking away from them like, i don't know for some of you you're definitely dealing with a very spiteful person here now it's not necessarily that their attempts are going to work but you definitely have somebody here that is plotting i want to say so we got the strength card energy here whatever's happening though i see you getting through it for some of you could be dealing with the leo we got the sun and the strength here You may have somebody helping you through it here. I'm just looking at that card. Um, you may have somebody that's helping you, helping you stay balanced, helping you, and this could be vice versa. Maybe you're helping this person, helping you stay calm. Because there's a lot. Somebody, yeah, helping you stay level-headed here. We got the Two of Swords. So there is going to be, ooh, my right ear just started ringing here. Somebody like... I just immediately heard someone doesn't, there's something that someone doesn't want you to know. Like for some of you, I am getting keep it see, uh, secret relationship, but it's like somebody's on to you. This is the reading is not going to be for everyone. I'm definitely getting that. Somebody's on to you, trying to catch you, having to keep something a secret. Ooh, I just heard somebody's crazy. Like I feel like somebody here... They're very hurt. I just heard like woman scorned type of shit. Like the devil. Yeah. Can we deal with Capricorn? But yeah, somebody somebody wants to know what's going on with you. Could be an ex. And I do feel like with the setting the record straight, you may be setting this person straight once and for all. This ooh, I just heard stalking. Somebody like definitely could be stalking you. We have the eight of swords because they're so I want to say stuck, like this person's so stuck and they are starting to act out is kind of what I'm getting. They're creeping around, starting to act out. This person could drink with that devil card energy. Maybe when they get drunk, they do stupid shit. I feel, oh, God damn. Okay, this reading is not for everyone. I just heard child services photo proof this. Ooh, okay. Do not take this if this is not your message. Somebody here could be trying to like kidnap their own kid. Is kind of what I'm getting, like trying to get child services called and then look at that card. Definitely be very careful for whoever. Maybe they're trying to steal your money, bank failure. Just definitely be careful. Of course, that is not going to be for everyone, but there is somebody here that has a plan to sabotage your life in some sort of way because you moved on and they see you doing better. Absolutely use your intuition at this time for sure. Uh, we got three pentacles. So ooh, they, maybe they've been planning this for a while. Maybe they've been planning this. Five of pentacles. Yeah, they feel left out in the cold by you. Yeah, this is giving like woman scorned crazy ex type energy. So again, this is not going to be for everyone. And I do feel like you could be in a relationship or connecting with somebody else, but you have to keep it a secret because this person is literally plotting. Like you feel it. Whoever I'm picking up on, you're intuitive, the high priestess. You may pull cards yourself, like you're just, or you just know. Um, there's something, like you just can't, you got to figure this out. Like you got to set the record straight. You got to figure something out before you make this super public because you know with this devil card energy, this person is going to try to sabotage it. But the thing is, this person is already catching on. They're trying to get evidence. They could be asking around if you have mutual friends. They could be asking around. You got the king of swords. So you could be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But this person is literally, yeah, they're planning hidden agenda, the five of swords. So yeah, for some of you, you are you are dealing with you're dealing with someone. I want to say dangerous. They just want to cause drama in your life. Ooh, I just heard. Yeah, this reading is not going to be for everyone. I just heard if I can't have you, no one can. Type of thing. So yeah, definitely. If this is your reading, be sure that you're taking the proper action here because somebody feels like you just threw them in the trash. That's how they feel. They know they fucked up, but the problem is this person, I want to say mentally unstable. 
is kind of what I'm getting with this energy. Why is a strength card here? And you definitely have saying the reason this person came into your life and it's to help you navigate this energy and this new person that you're connecting with, it's not going to scare them away. I don't feel that, but they're definitely here to help you. Why is a strength card here? Because you did the right thing by leaving is what I'm getting. But yeah, I, I definitely feel like this person, whoever this is, that is like acting crazy or whatever. Hmm. Yeah, I'm definitely getting the energy of this person may get arrested for what they are attempting to do. Let's see. They, they, they just want to break up your happy home. That's kind of what I'm getting like, because they feel like you're happy on your own, but they now are assuming or they know that you're with someone else because they've been creeping. Why is it two of swords here? Yeah, keep your guard up. I feel like this person will try to lie to come back in. They may try to emotionally manipulate you. They may try to make you feel bad or feel guilty. Why is the devil card here? Yeah, the Six of Cups. It's a crazy ex, and they are coming in trying to cause some mayhem, like the, the tower. They're trying to cause this shit for you. And it's because this rage and this passion is coming because they found out you're with someone else. Again, if I can't have you, no one can. For some of you, you can be done with the Scorpio. Why is the Eight of Swords energy here? The King of Swords again. You got the King of Swords here twice. This person has been planning this. Like the Five of Swords, it's a plan. Why is the Three of Pentacles? And I do not feel, yeah, it's, for some of you, it's going to be someone you were married to, the Hierophant, Taurus energy. <clears throat> the thing is, like, I don't know. I don't feel like you're in danger because if you listen to your intuition and you, you know, keep your guard up and move smart, you're good. You may already know what this person's up to. I mean, I feel like you know that this person's like this. But yeah, I'm definitely getting the energy. They're trying to catch you up with something. They're trying to get you in trouble. They're trying to either get your kids taken away or kidnap their kids. Like if you guys have kids together, like they may try and do this. Like they're trying to get evidence on you about something. Like they're trying to do something. And it's because they feel like, and this is not on you. This is on them. They feel like you just threw them away because you, you're just dusting it off. Like, okay, I'm, I'm done with this. I'm just going to do what I need to do for myself. They feel like you threw them in the trash. Why is the Five of Pentacles here? They feel so left out in the cold. They feel abandoned. Yeah, the King of Pentacles. They feel abandoned by you. For some of you, you could be dealing with an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I feel like this person put a lot of their self worth on this relationship, and they're really struggling. But the thing is, they were maybe they cheated on you. They fucked up. Whoever this is, so you had to walk away. So clarifying the Eight of Pentacles, we have the Six of Wands, the Six of Pentacles, and the Four of Cups. As long as you keep avoiding this and you keep focused and you keep doing what you need to do, things are going to continue to move forward for you. But I do feel like this reading here was here to make you aware that this person is plotting some shit. Like, you're safe, you're good, but this was, this, it's definitely meant to make you aware. Why is the King of Swords here? Yeah. The Ace of Cups. Spirit's bringing you this new person uh, to help you. And there's a very strong love connection here between you and somebody else, and it is new. Aces are new. Why is the Five of Swords here? And the thing is, I feel like, again, what fueled this person's fire completely, because they were already fucked up about you leaving them, is that you moved on. And the thing is, I'm getting that maybe you and this person have been broken up for a while. So... It's like, it could be a little bit surprising to you as to why this person is all of a sudden blowing the fuck up, but it's because you're connecting with somebody new and whoever this person is, they're very connected to you. They feel it. They know they have to, they feel it. Maybe they don't know it yet, but they feel it. They're like, okay, they're with somebody else. So yeah, definitely be careful. Be careful here. Listen to your intuition. Because somebody feels very left out in the cold by you. It's like, you. I'm getting that you were their everything. In the sense that, again, they put their self-worth based on the relationship that you two had. And they just feel like you threw them in the trash. But the problem is, this person, you had to walk away because they fucked up. 
So you had to protect yourself. I'm going to pull some timing cards as far as this new relationship, because I feel like this person's already in your life, honestly. But I feel like things are going to move forward between you and this new person, and they're supposed to. But advice is definitely to use your discernment when doing things, when posting things, or whatever. And it's not that you have to, like, hide your life, but I'm getting there's somebody on your ass, is what I'm feeling. There's somebody on your ass. Have faith that divine timing is at play. One more. Okay. Yeah, exactly. A waste of your time. In entertaining this person that you already threw away the waste of your time so i do hope that this reading was helpful for you guys if you would like a personal reading you can visit my website at swordstarot.com also for those of you interested in learning how to read tarot my trading is down below and i'll see you guys in the next video